going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's another Marvel Monday and today we're going to be checking out Black Panther. Another Marvel Monday. It's crazy because these Mondays just keep coming so fast. Sounds sexual and weird as hell. Nonetheless, to get a little bit morbid on you, that's a whole nother week of your life that you're never gonna get back. Cross it off the list. One more week closer to death. I am so fucking stoked for this. One, because I've never seen this movie and I've heard tremendous things about it. And then second is, dude, do you know what the movie is for next week? Avengers Infinity War. I am so, so excited, man. So, guys, if you want access to the full-length movie reactions or the ability to vote in the polls for the next non-Marvel movie, link to the Patreon will be at the top of the description. And if you are not subscribed right now, what? What are you doing? I think like something like 73% of you guys that watch these videos are not subscribed. So, slap that subscribe button harder than you slap your gooch. And let's get cooking, shall we? You guys get to chill out today with your boy Alex, aka Mr. Uh, keep a couple popcorn kernels stuffed in your bra. Why did I say that? <laughs> I don't wear bras, but I put one on before. What am I saying? Let's go. Let's watch the movie. A meteorite made of vibranium. Vibranium. The strongest substance in the universe. All right, so we got the element that's gonna dictate the movie, huh? The panther goddess Bust, who led him to the plant that granted him superhuman strength, speed, and instinct. Oh shit. Dude eats a plant and gets superpowers? Holy shit. It's gotta be hard to find, right? Cause what happens if a little kid happens upon it, turns into a goddamn Black Panther? The Wakandans used vibranium to develop technology more advanced than any other nation. To keep vibranium safe, the Wakandans vowed to hide in plain sight. Wow. Keeping the truth of their power from the outside world. 1992 before I was born. Oakland, California, let's go, baby. Never been to California. Would hate to live there, but I'd like to go. You in a van, <clears throat> come in through from the west, come around the Uh-oh, got some delinquents. Okay, we're coming. Uh-oh. Is it the feds? <laughs> no. It's the neighborhood kids playing damn basketball, bro. <laughs> Relax. These two Grace Jones looking chicks. Who? Open it. Is this guy who plays Chris Darden in The People vs. OJ? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> How did these women carry spears looking like that into this apartment complex and it didn't raise any questions? Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let me see how you are holding up. Oh, shit. Black Panther's brother? <laughs> Dude's, Dude's like, what the fuck is going on here? Who the fuck is this guy? Ulysses Claw stole a quarter ton of vibranium from us. He had someone on the inside. Why are you here? Oh shit. Probably because he thinks you did it, dude. Because I want you to look me in the eyes. Oh, look him in his fucking eye, bitch. And tell me why you betrayed Wakanda. I did no such thing. Zuri. Son of Badu. Oh shit, he's one too? Who are you, dude? Goddamn Benedict Arnold? Fucking traitor. Damn. You will return home at once and inform them of your crimes. <laughs> Boy's loyal to Wakanda, man. I don't give a fuck if it's his brother or not. Marvel movies are so sick, man. I'm already really disappointed that it's gonna be over at some point. Or not over, but I will have caught up, right? The beloved ruler was one of many confirmed dead after a terrorist attack at the United Nations a week ago. Succession of the throne is expected to fall to the oldest of the king's two children, Prince T'Challa. Coming up on them now. What? No need to call you. I can handle this alone. Hmm. <laughs> All right, let's see if that's true or not. Just don't freeze when you see her. What are you talking about? I never freeze. Mefaru, what's going on? Defense position. Are we under attack? He's saying defense position. All your cars stopped working. Are we under attack? Yeah, no shit, dude. It doesn't seem good, does it? Oh. Oh shit. Oh, 
suit is bulletproof. Dude, he's ripping everybody's gooch out. Wallahi, I will shoot her right now. <laughs> no, he said he didn't need her <laughs> Looks like he did. My father is dead, Nakia. I will be crowned king tomorrow. And I wish for you to be there. That's sick. Can he be the Black Panther and the king at the same time? I guess so, right? You speak nothing of this day. <laughs> she, she's sick. What the fuck? I'm confused with the damn methods of transportation here. I don't know. <laughs> oh shit! Hiding in plain sight, but how does that even how does that even work? What the fuck? People out here thinking this is the poorest nation ever. Doesn't look like it to me. Take it to the river province to prepare for the ceremony. Yes, General. It's so cool. I want my wife to greet me like that every time she sees me. Hello. It's fucking cool. Did he freeze? I can interlock in here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for the EMP beeps. I've developed an update. What do you know? More than you. <laughs> Can't wait to see what kind of update you make to your ceremonial outfit. Oh! Your middle finger translate in Wakandan culture as well? I guess it does. I mean, we have our answer, but seems weird. London. A lot of Marvel movies taking place in London. Or, you know, we visit there often. Good morning. Just checking out these artifacts. <laughs> Michael B. Jordan, I love this dude. Also from Benin, 7th century. Fula tribe, I believe. My girl's got gastrointestinal issues or what? It's from Wakanda. And it's made out of vibranium. Don't trip. I'm gonna take it off your hands for you. These items aren't for sale. How do you think your ancestors got these? Okay. Weird energy. You ain't checking for what you put in your body. <gasps> oh, fuck. What the hell did he do? Hey, somebody get some help. Come here. Call the doctor, huh? please. <laughs> what are you, what are you slipping her a drink? Damn ricin? I'm gonna take a break. She's in on it too, huh? Please. Come here, come here. You can go, but just don't tell anyone, all right? Oh, oh my God, dude. Are you serious? Gave him the littlest bit of hope. He's like, my family, I get to see you. Fucking dude, it's ridiculous. Oh gosh. <laughs> this dude sniffing the fucking weapon. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It smells just like my grandmother. You're not telling me that's vibranium too, huh? No, I'm just feeling it. <laughs> Michael B. Jordan's so cool. I wanna be him. Oh! Okay, all right, well. Dude, African cultures have like the coolest- What the fuck is in that guy's lip? Damn, that's so cool. Fritz, we now have the Black Panther stripped away. Oh God, he's not gonna be the Black Panther anymore. If any tribe wishes to put forth a warrior, I now offer a path to the throne. We're not. Will not, will not, will not challenge today. Gosh, bro, that is, oh, the stretched lip. I get that that's cultural, but that looks painful, man. Ow. Who wishes to challenge for the throne? <laughs> Could we all just wrap it up and go home? <laughs> oh, shit. Asi Jabari. Yes. Who could not keep his own father safe. Okay. I accept your challenge. Mbaku is pretty fucking big, dude. I mean, Chadwick, you look swole too, dude. You look healthy, but damn. Might as well like put some damn popcorn in that dude's bowl. Just a quick delivery method. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Why do I feel like one of them is gonna fall off the waterfall? It's gonna happen, right? Oh! Oh! Kind of a cool thing though, like, you can challenge the next king, right? Because it really promotes, I guess, the most feared or the most talented or the strongest being on the throne. Oh God, they're right at the end, dude! You have fought with honor, now yield! 
Boy tapped out. It's funny like what things still hold true just for the audience sake, like tapping out. Is that something that is like known around the world? I don't know. King T'Challa, the Black Panther. So you can be both. Wakanda forever! Uh, there's, uh, there's a thing. That's something that I know about the film that uh, I didn't even have to watch it to get. Just being on social media, I get that. Oh shit, there are those heart-shaped plants. Allow the heart-shaped up to restore the powers of the Black Panther. Wait, why did they strip him of his powers for the fight? Still kicked his ass without the power. Oh yeah, fuck, I forgot about that. <gasps> Oh, that's what he was saying when he was saying that he can't save his father. Oh, wow. What movie was that again? Gosh, I, was that an Avengers? Like just watching these movies one time all the way through, it's still, there's still a lot where I'm like, wait, which, which one was that? Whoa, fucking Panthers just in the tree, crazy. Oh, what? People can turn from human to jungle cat? Oh, that's his dad, wow. Oh, he gets to go to this plane to see his father. Stand up. You are a king. I am not ready to be without you. Oh, man. A man who has not prepared his children for his own death has failed as a father. Have I ever failed you? Never. Oh, shit. I want to be a great king, Baba. Just like you. You're going to struggle. <laughs> so you need to surround yourself with people you trust. You're a good man. And it's hard for a good man to be king. Wow. Probably holds true for just anybody in power. Thinking about the damn presidents of our country. Probably hard for a good man to be president. Who would y'all go visit if you could just go to that plane and see somebody who had passed away? Drop a comment down below. That could get kind of intense and, and dramatic, but... Let me know, that'd be really interesting. What would you have Wakanda do about it? We could provide aid and access to technology and refuge to those who need it. Other countries do it, we could do it better. We could lose our way of life. Wakanda is strong enough to help others and protect ourselves at the same time. If you are not so stubborn, you would make a great queen. I would make a great queen because I am so stubborn. <laughs> <laughs> if that's what I Nokia, Nokia? No, that's the phone. Nokia, uh, Nokia, yeah, all right. It's a huge fucking it's rhino growing. and they're, okay. You're gonna put the rhino in a cage made of very small branches? It's not gonna do shit. Kia thinks we should be doing more. Foreign aid, refugee programs. You let the refugees in, they bring their problems with them. And then Wakanda is like everywhere else. Filled with problems. You too, huh? My king. What? My love. Oh. You never guess who just popped up on our radar. They're lovers. Ulysses Claw plans to sell the vibranium to an American buyer in South Korea tomorrow night. You kill him where he stands? Kill him where he stands? Or you bring him back to us? I will bring him back. Okay, all right, bring him back. So I guess all of these technological advances, all of the damn projections of people whenever they call is made from vibranium? Guess so. Powerful ass element, Jesus. My king. Stop it, stop it. What are these? The real question is, what are those? Oh no, don't do that. I wanted to go old school. <laughs> Double-edged sword when you use a pop culture reference like that because people in the moment, whenever that's popular, they're like, oh shit, yeah, that's cool. They, you know, that's they're up to date with the times, but then it totally ages the movie, right? I can't remember the last time someone said, what are those? My design. Old tech. Hey, people are shooting at me, wait. Let me put on my helmet. Enough. <laughs> I love the brother-sister relationship. <laughs> she just gives him so much shit. It's awesome. That's uh, sick. The idea is to not be noticed. Okay. Okay. No way. No fucking way. Strike it. Anyway. Mm-hmm. Not that hard, genius. <laughs> He starts breaking shit. The nanites absorb the kinetic energy and hold it in place for redistribution. Whoa! Strike it again in the same spot. You're recording. For research purposes. She sets you up. <laughs> Delete that footage. Delete that footage. South Korea. Is that a country any of y'all want to actually go visit? 
Would you want that or no? Past willing, this will go quickly and I can get this ridiculous thing off my head. Just whip it back and forth, man. It's a disgrace. <laughs> Super crazy side eye. Are they really playing the weekend in South Korea? Will there be any trouble tonight, Miss Kenya? Probably. Depends <laughs> on how quickly we finish the mission. Mm. Americans, I count three. Five. How could you miss Grace Lightning there behind you? <laughs> Six. Agent Ross. Your Highness. You are buying from Klopp. What I'm doing or not doing on behalf of the U.S. government is none of your concern. No way the fucking U.S. government is buying it? I think I'll just take these, <laughs> bring them over here, and hold on for safekeeping. Stan Lee, you're a real one. When the dust settles, you and me can work something out. I'm not here to make a deal. He's here to get damn claws. Wait, claw? Claws? Circumcision day, baby! Shit's going down! Quite... The Entourage. You got a mixtape coming out? Yeah, I'll send you the SoundCloud link if you like. Oh, no. Wait, boy's actually a damn SoundCloud rapper? <laughs> you got the diamonds. Okay, that's enough. Stop rubbing my shoulder, freak. Hi, right, Brainy. You literally put it in your dick? Okay. Throws a rug on his face and... Ow. Ow! <laughs> okay. Holy shit! Oh yeah, he's got, okay, he's got, he got powers. You look just like your old man. Oh my god, what in the hell was that? I made it rain. You know what I'd be doing? <laughs> I made it rain. <laughs> <laughs> He's fucking snagging dollars left and right. Oh, that was awesome! That was awesome! Stop stroking your Willis and get in the car, dude. My god. Put some music on. What do you think this is, the funeral? What? Put some music on? What are you... They're trying to lose us. We'll take the right. Driving barefoot's actually a really fun sensation. I really do like that. I heard it's illegal though. I have no idea if that's true or not. I guess it's a simple Google search, but. Oh. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, yeah, you just fucking ran over it, dude. It's a vibranium car, you idiots. The bullets won't penetrate. Vibranium car, that's insane. Bullets cannot penetrate vibranium. I just spit everywhere. Yeah. Wow. Dang, that's so cool. Oh, shit. So what he shot goes through vibranium, right? I guess maybe that was vibranium. Who knows? Oh shit, dude! Boys fucking ship shaped and all over the uh, ship shaping <laughs> all over the place. Jesus. Oh fuck! Where did you get this weapon? Just bring him and let's go. Fucking punch him out. He just looks just he's such a fucking dumbass looking dude. <laughs> he's just so stupid looking. I can see you. Okay, I can see you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he's dumb, but he's funny. He's in my custody now. He's not going anywhere. Listen, I'm doing you guys a favor by letting you even be in here. <laughs> Touch him again. Your gooch is going on your face. I don't know how that's going to happen, but it will. I do appreciate your help, Musa. You probably put some on your shoulder or something. Shepherds, textiles, cool outfits. It's all a front. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. You're telling me that weapon on your arm is from Wakanda? Oh shit. Okay, first of all, the dude has a giant gash in his head. He needs medical attention. This is not good. Fuck. And you stole all their vibranium. <laughs> I stole all of it. My dude's got one arm and he's tied to a chair. You're still flinching? All of it. Now I want to know how that dude got in and out of Wakanda with all the information, all the knowledge, all the whereabouts, everything. Claw stole all the vibranium you had, but now he's telling me you have more? And you believe the word of an arms dealer strapped to a chair? Just so happens he's telling the truth, but yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> he 
Jesus. I wouldn't have picked that mask, you know? The hair flailing out is kind of a vibe, but not one that I'm necessarily about. I see you took your time, didn't you? Oh, what the fuck was that? He just jumped in front of me. <gasps> oh. I don't hit his spine. Oh. This will stabilize him for now. <gasps> we can save him. Think about the research though. I mean, that makes sense why the US government would want to be involved. You can have all of these crazy technological advances, all this stabilization from a health perspective. I mean, that can literally help a ton of people. Could also be some of the most destructive stuff ever. He took a bullet for me. That was his choice. I cannot just let him die. You need a little bit more compassion and empathy, okay? Wow. Where is Glow? He slipped through our hands. For 30 years, your father was in power and did nothing. With you, I thought it would be different. Oh. But it's more of the same. Oh. That hurts. Drop it! Did he just fucking shoot her? Oh my god, did she die? Okay, taking that dude out was relatively easy for uh, good old MBJ. This is what they do to people like us. I ain't worried about no brain. Check these out. Each one is for a kill. You're crazy to think that you could walk in there. <gasps> <laughs> okay, well, that dude's taken care of, eh? What happened to my uncle? Jobo, there was a man today. He helped Kro escape from us and he was wearing this ring. My grandfather's ring. Wow. I promised the king to say nothing. I am your king now! Yeah, okay. Your uncle took a war dog assignment in America. Your father placed me there. Oh shit, that was him? What? Our people suffer because they don't have the tools to fight back. We knew your father would not support this. Your uncle helped Claw steal the vibranium. Wow. He's a weapon on me. What? Oh shit. Your father killed his own brother to save my life. Oh fuck, so that's who it is. It's Michael B. We had to maintain the light. Oh. Okay, his hair is fucking cool. It's really cool. What is this? Just a little gift. Ngwan. Oh, I can't tell, dude. There's still a lot of ambiguity for me. I can't tell if Michael B. Jordan's character is good or bad. Ugh. Oh. Well, you're completely good. Your spine's good. You get your spine back from the people of Wakanda, and I think that you're probably gonna be on their side from now on. Bullet wounds don't just magically heal overnight. They do here. But not by magic, by technology. How soon before our society starts having this type of technology? Fucking okay, bullet wound cured in a day or less? Incredible. That That's magnetic levitation, right? Obviously. <laughs> obviously. Magnetic levitation. Yeah, obviously, no shit. I developed a way to temporarily deactivate it. Who is this fucking chick, dude? She created this? How old are you, 14? <laughs> Goddamn wizard of the mind. That type of shit is nuts. iPhone 14, that's what it better be like. <laughs> An outsider. No, a Wakandan. He's not a Wakandan, he's one of ours. What? What is he? He's got the blue thing in his lip. He's got the ring. How is he not Wakandan? What? Killed his own brother and left a child behind. What kind of man does that? No man is perfect. Wow. This man's over here pouring his heart out about his dad and I'm over here crunching my chompers down on some goddamn pieces of popcorn feeling like a rock. <laughs> Sorry about that. You can't let your father's mistakes define who you are. 100%. Something that so many people struggle with, including myself. I'm like, my dad's a fucking scumbag. I mean, that might sound kind of harsh. I haven't seen him since sixth grade because he fled, but... Did he reveal anything about his identity? He has a war dog tattoo, but... We have no record of him. This is so cool. This is so cool. I'm standing in your house. My man is forward as hell. I want the throne. <laughs> hey. And I want Shania Twain to give me a tuggy. It's about two billion people all over the world that looks like us. Wakanda has the tools to liberate them all. 
And the water told us. Vibranium. Yep. Found my daddy with panther claws in his chest. You ain't the son of a king, you are a son of a murderer. Oh God. <gasps> oh shit. I'm exercising my blood right. The consonant pronunciation. I'm exercising my blood right. It's great acting. I accept your challenge. Oh shit. Oh shit, dude. Okay, I don't think this is gonna be as easy as the first go around. Now I have the strength of the Black Panther strip. Oh, okay, so I guess like whoever's king, do they get the powers as well? Just to make sure, hey, let's take away his power to make sure he's the strongest individual. I like that. Sick. Throw down your weapons and we can handle this another way. I don't think he's gonna do that. I train, I lie, I kill. Yeah, he's got an arm full of bumps. Oh, I fuck! Okay, never mind. Terrifying. Looks like boy has some type, type of skin condition. Honestly, like the most epic place to fight. It looks so pretty. Oh! Oh! I felt that! Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Ow. This is for my father. I am the cause of your father's death. I'll take you both, Uncle James. No! Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Is this your game? Oh, no. That does not look good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't throw him off the edge. Oh, no. No. Oh my god. Boy literally just recycled him over the edge. I'm your kid. Oh my god, I guess they have to do that. Oh shit. Just like that, the king gets switched up? Fucking hell. I am loyal to the throne. What are you loyal to? These nuts. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Those bumps on his body, ah! My mind goes to like, if he scratches his arm, would he scratch one off? Probably not, but it's like, ew. God, that's sad. <laughs> I keep finding like popcorn on the blanket. I'm like, yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> okay, I thought dude was gonna go like talk to his dad that died prematurely. Dude cracks a book. Fuck. What did I tell you about going into my things? No tears for me? Everybody dies. Damn. It's just life around here. Kid's got no real remorse or like empathy, huh? Like, yeah, that's just the way it is. <laughs> Dude is fucking swole as hell. Michael B. Jordan literally could pro probably have any woman he wants. Yeah, go ahead and burn all that. My king, we cannot do that. <gasps> <gasps> okay. Okay, that's too much rage. When I tell you to do something, I mean that shit. Okay. Burn it all! That's not a sound plan. Super cool shot. Love that shot. All right, well, homegirl stole some of that heart-shaped herb, so I think that we're good there. We're gonna send vibranium weapons out to our war dogs. They'll arm oppress people all over the world. Let's get to it. <laughs> Uh, I can kind of understand why they're doing that, but at the same time, it's just like, it doesn't seem right. I kind of wish it was right, because I'd be badass, but, ah, uh, it just goes against, like, their culture, right? Ah, uh, Jesus, you got these fucking mountain fur snowmen. <laughs> what? One more word, and I will feed you to my children. Oh! I'm kidding, we are vegetarians. <laughs> okay. This is why we are here, to offer this to you. Damn, giving him the extra hand up, leg up. That's what it is. Come with me. Impossible. Is he there? Oh my god, they found him, huh? One of our fishermen found him at the edge of the river border. So, I'm just a little bit confused. Wouldn't the snow fermin, like, want to go kill him so that he could have eaten the magical plant and possibly become king? Right? The time has come for you to come home and be reunited with me. No, no, it's not time for that. <laughs> 
to turn our backs on the rest of the world. We let the fear of our discovery stop us from doing what is right. Oh, shit. I cannot stay here with you. So he agrees with Michael B. Jordan that they should have done something to help the rest of the world, right? I must right these wrongs. <laughs> yes! Yes! Okay, time to get B. Jordan off the goddamn throne, let's go! If he gets control of our technology... Then it's fucking game over, yeah. He's gonna blast everybody out. <gasps> the Black Panther lives. It's good to have you back, man. It's so good to have you back. We will not help you. I have a feeling you're gonna... He's gonna help, right? It's for the plot. Yeah. Soundtrack is slapping though, dude. Held sonic cannon, powerful enough to stop a tank. And traceable by metal detectors. And you think it's a good idea to give people all around the world access to those weapons? Nah. Nope, I don't like that. <laughs> Let's go! Wait, didn't Michael B. Jordan drink some stuff to make him the Black Panther as well? Are there two Black Panthers? Oh my god, they're gonna Black Panther battle it out. I never yielded! I am not dead! All that challenge shit is over with. I'm the king now. Bambi! Bambi? You are not fit to be a king! Okay, yup, there he is. He said, fuck y'all, shield. I'll just hurdle over it. Oh, hell yes! Well, call me stop this! Come on, dude from Black Mirror, stop! Oh, shit! They're armored rhinos! Oh my god! What? You were a great pilot. Don't worry, I'll guide you through it. Well, you guys have hover bikes? <laughs> I've never ridden a hover bike! Yeah, I, I don't know what I'm we're doing counting on you. with this. Figure it out, dude. Sink or swim time. Wakanda forever. <gasps> Oh. Game time, bitches. Remote piloting system activated. Fly time, baby, come on. Okay, casually take it out of a damn armored rhino, dude. Black Panther's armor, dude, is sick. Ow. Where the hell did that come from? Wow. What is happening? Why are they anti-gravity fighting? That purple suit is sick. I'd pick the purple one. Although black and gold's a good combo. Shit, it's hard to beat. Turn on the train on the bottom track. You won't have protection! Neither will he. Okay, back to the fighting then without the fucking Black Panther suits. The world took everything away from me. Everything I ever loved. Oh. The abused becomes the abuser. It's a classic cycle. Put me back in. <gasps> oh, dude, what a hero. Oh, that gave me chills, dude. You see them hair sticking up? You have three seconds to lay down your weapon. <laughs> <laughs> First time. Yeah! Let's fucking go. Yeah! Jabbery, you fucking badasses. Fucking savages in like a good the good type of savage, right? Okay. Both rear back and jackknife kicked each other in the face with their head. System rebooted. So clutch! So clutch! Oh! Yes! Dude! You did good, buddy! That is a terrifying sight. Aww! He likes her! Aww! Giant fucking gorilla dog. Would you kill me, my love? <laughs> really, dude? Suck yourself. Push him into the train! Gosh, why is everything about this movie about people falling over the edge? This is it for you, cousin? I don't think so, B. Jordan. <laughs> I can't tell who that was! Okay, B. Jordan. 
All right, yeah, suck that. Hell of a move. Fucking badass, it was what it was. Y'all gonna say anything to each other or are we gonna sit here in silence? Oh, Pop said Wakanda was the most beautiful thing you ever seen. Mm. He promised he was gonna show it to me one day. You believe that? A kid from Oakland running around believing in fairy tales. Wait, is this some type of plot twist? Is he playing with your emotions to get you to lower your guard and he's gonna fucking do something weird? <laughs> okay, maybe not. That is so cool. He's beautiful. <laughs> Everything the light touches will be yours. Maybe we can still heal you. So you can just lock me up? Seems like a weird response. Someone trying to help you? Bury me in the ocean. Okay. With my ancestors that jumped from the ships, because they knew death was better than bondage. <gasps> Don't take it out! Oh my god, boy literally just killed himself like that. Oh my gosh, my Donald. Damn. I didn't know Michael B. Jordan was gonna be the bad guy in this movie. Fuck. We got the king back. You saved me. It was my duty to fight for what I love. I should have. <gasps> I can't blame me, I almost died. <laughs> Touches Willis. I think I know a way you can still fulfill your calling. Oh, God. Please stay. I think I know how you can still, uh... Keep that calling of yours. <laughs> sound like a damn intro of a softcore porn. I think I know a way you can still fulfill your calling. Wow, full circle. Oh, wow. There we go. I like how they still have the old basket, though. Pays homage to, like, the old school nature of it, but shows the advancement, right? Very cool. When you said you would take me to California for the first time, I thought you meant Coachella. <laughs> Coachella? Seriously? Oh, man. The pop culture references. I get it, but I could go without them. Eh, the Coachella one was all right. I'm still thinking about the what are those. This is where our father killed our uncle. I bought this building. This will be the first Wakanda International Outreach Center. Oh, uh, <gasps> what? You will spearhead the science and information exchange. That is so cool. That is so cool. Bugatti spaceship. Bugatti spaceship. I woke up in a new Bugatti spaceship. We can break it apart, we can sell it. Break it apart and sell it. Yeah, what are you gonna do? How are you gonna label that? Who are you? I'm the Black Panther, bitch. Hey! That's a good movie, man. Where are the end credit scenes? Come on! Vienna, Austria. Beautiful. Been to Vienna before. Just one time. Absolutely unreal, though. And for the first time in our history, we will be sharing our knowledge and resources. Yes. We all know the truth. More connects us than separates us. Yeah, I love that. We must find a way to look after one another as if we were one single mm. tribe. Wow. <laughs> what are y'all doing? <laughs> are you playing around with that man again? Who is the man? <laughs> Oh, <gasps> Bucky? Wait, is that, is that fucking Bucky? Good morning, Sergeant Barnes. Bucky. How are you feeling? Good. What? I am confused. How the fuck did Bucky get to Wakanda? Should I know that? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Dude, I mean, that movie was fucking crazy cool for a number of reasons, right? Just like Wakanda itself, but more so than that, like the costume design was awesome. It was so cool. Having Wakanda being this like ultimate utopian society, it was, it was really cool to see like this entire civilization structured in such a technologically advanced way. We see a lot of that in Thor with Asgard. Um, we saw that in Guardians of the Galaxy, but like here it's just, it does a really good job of that same thing as well. The vast majority of the characters in this movie though, like we have not been introduced to. So having that well-rounded nature to the characters allows us to be introduced to them, but actually 
empathize and really like them. It's like one of those factors of a movie that goes unnoticed to a lot of people. Something that was also very cool about the movie was just the sheer amount of like women characters and how badass they were. Now in Hollywood especially, women are ultra sexualized, right? So for this movie, it wasn't the case at all. You just had some genuine badass women. And then the elephant in the room is the fact that this movie was extremely relevant to the real world, right? Definitely had like a pop culture spin to the movie, but it was a very inspiring movie for a lot of reasons. Almost an all black cast. Everybody that took part in making this movie did a fantastic job making this huge fucking world renowned, innovative, groundbreaking, landmark type iconic movie that really represented what a lot of the world thinks is an underrepresented class of people. Such a well done movie. And guys, guess fucking what? Next up, we got Avengers Infinity War. Y'all better be there. I'm gonna be there. And you better be slapping your gooch pretty damn hard to that one. And I'll see you guys next week. I wanna say thank you guys so much for tuning into this reaction and checking it out with me. And as always, if you want access to the full length movie reactions or the ability to vote in the polls for the next non Marvel movie, link to the Patreon will be at the top of the description. And I will see you guys, beautiful sons of bitches, in the next one. Woo! Well, overshot it. <laughs> Love you guys. Peace!